Hello, adventurers! We're gonna go out, we're gonna go out with a bag, right? That's racist. Misdirection. You never had a problem with my, with my, the way I do things, no? <laughs> so what was your experience? Uh, I got enough experience with the program that we were using because I, I do all the editing and all the, all the technical things. Yeah, I got enough experience with the program to find out that I liked it a lot more than the program I was using. Yeah, I remember so, you fought me. Yeah, no, I did because I knew how to use that program. Like I, I knew how to use Sony Vegas. Mm -hmm. I knew how to use it. Like. Everything that we we were doing with uh, Premiere, I knew how to use. But then once I learned how to use Premiere, I was I found out that it's a lot more intuitive mm. than using um, Sony Vegas. Because like um, if I wanted to say like if I wanted to apply like um, remember the dancing episode in season four where I had the video of us like on the on the bottom and then I had us um, the person who was talking about whatever they're they're, they're going to do next show up mm. and also have that green screen in the back. Mm -hmm. um, in order for me to do that, I had to op right click open a lot of menus in Sony Vegas. Uh -huh. But for it Adobe Premiere, it Adobe Premiere, I just clicked on the clip, clicked on the clip, and all of it's there for me. So you know, like that's that's what I learned. And then um, I started uh, because of that. I started um, slot four, um, where we do let's plays, and we're eventually going to start doing little short skits, and that's going to be pretty fun. But I'm definitely going to take the stuff that we learned here into there. Yeah, but yeah, that's those are those are my experiences. I I, I found out that I evolved the Lyle character. Yeah, <laughs> like I'm damn good at the Lyle character. I, right when we cut off work in progress, I'm freaking good at the Lyle character. I remember with the first season. <laughs> if you ever watched the first season of Work in Progress, Lyle's voice is normal. Like this. Yeah, Lyle's, like this. Lyle's voice is normal. The whole time, and at first I told, uh, I remember I told you. Yeah, you're like, you should do the you loud do, voice. You do the loud voice. Because the loud voice was a thing. Yeah, yeah. It was a thing before. Yeah. Before like, we work in progress. Yeah, because whenever we told stories about, with, with me and AJ, we would always use his voice. It was always up. And then whenever we mentioned my brother, it was always like this. Yeah, it was, it was our always voice always was the high voice. voice. Yeah, so our voice is always like this. It's like, yeah. Yeah, so, yeah. girl. <laughs> it's always like that. We always say, say stories like that. So it's like, oh, they will use the law of voice. Yeah, That's the law of voice. And then you fought me. And then the <laughs> second season, we just threw everything away. <laughs> I remember us when we, we filmed the first episode of the second season. And I went straight in with the law of voice. And we had to cut to just start laughing. <laughs> I don't think we have a clip for that. But if we do have a clip of that, it's going to be right here. But yeah, like, I, we cut. <laughs> you, you're like, stop. Stop. Yeah, and, then, and then you're like, yeah, so you're just going to do it? Because <laughs> you fought me so hard yeah, yeah, the first yeah. season. So, yeah, so then I just started doing so it. So the loud voice. Yeah, and then, like, as the seasons went on, it went less awkward and me, like, me breaking my voice, and I actually started doing it better. So, like, now now the loud voice has range, and now the loud character knows how to kind of act. Because um, there's, there's an episode in um, season four with me and Alan, and that, that scene where um, you, wa you walked into the kitchen... And uh, you're like, well, well, where we got, what were we guys doing? And we're talking about the the wedding. Oh, oh. And when when we filmed that, I don't know if you felt it, but it felt really fluid because we were it rattling feels, those lines that, off. Now, now the law voice feels like your real voice. <laughs> In my head, that's the way you sound. <laughs> now, <laughs> that's, like you're changing your voice right now to act manly. In my head. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> the voice is like, okay, I'm gonna be on lines for the peoples. <laughs> So I'm gonna talk like this. <laughs> this is what I talk like normally. This. <laughs> Great. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Another experience is that people take the internet far too seriously. Oh yeah. Because after season, was it after season one or after season two? It was after season. No, after season two. So after season two, Alan's uh, Alan's uh, aunt. Yeah. Thought the the Lyle character was Lyle. <laughs> She thought I was retarded. <laughs> she straight up thought 
I was retarded. <laughs> and that, that's when I found out that people on the internet take this shit way too seriously. Because <laughs> it's clearly a TV show. <laughs> I can't believe there's like some people out there that work watch work in progress is like, oh my god. This is these are people's lives. <laughs> and I'm out there, I'm out there like crashing an airplane into a Ferrari. Oh, yeah. I'm out there walking around in the Batman costume. Well, you we're actually walking out there in the Batman costume. Oh okay. to be fair. <laughs> Yeah. I remember when we in the I don't remember if it was the third if it was the third season or the second season where I, I, I there was like this running joke where Lyle couldn't open doors. <laughs> I remember I remember when I wrote that at first and you were like you were so mad. You were like that would never happen. I don't know what you're talking about. I know how to open doors. This will never happen in real life. And then like <laughs> Two to season like three, three, three months ago. Three months ago. I think it was three months ago. Yeah. <laughs> I saw Lyle <laughs> leave my room. I was reading a book. Yeah, I was gonna get something. He comes back and I heard a junk. <laughs> An owl. <laughs> yeah, an owl. <laughs> <laughs> there was another time where you locked my door. <laughs> you left. And not two seconds later, you ran into the door. And I was like... <laughs> Both times. <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> I, wonder, I, wonder, I wonder how many times all it does run into the door and work in progress. Let's see. Let's go see that. Okay, we're gonna be anxious. This is awesome. We're gonna love him. Push, not pull. Pull, not push. You almost got it. You almost got it. You open it. So, <coughs> oh, disclaimer, Lyle for reals is not like that. Kind of. Some of it's real. Some of it's Some real. Some of it I write. Some of it's real and you just expand upon it. That's that's what it is. Yeah, something. <laughs> so some of it is real, but you expand upon it. So yeah, um, we met a lot of friends. Yeah, yeah, we did. I remember doing the first collaboration episode. You weren't a part of that. That was one of the episodes where I had to like wing it by myself, which is, sounds hard. Hey everyone, this was a collaboration effort with other YouTubers. If you enjoyed them, why don't you check out their channels? And don't forget to subscribe, because it's the best way to get all of our content as soon as it comes out. And then, at the end, <laughs> he was a bad guy. That was, that was a nice twist, I didn't expect that. Well, okay, I, got the, the, I had two endings written. I had the one ending that you guys saw, and I had another ending... Like, if he wanted to do it, I didn't like, I wasn't going to force him to do it, so that's why I wrote too. Yeah. The other ending was that his mom would be telling him to like, oh, you need to get rid of that fat guy. And then he was going to go, yes, mother. <laughs> <laughs> Stroking his dog as she walked. No, 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 you know, it's like the <laughs> just mom is just behind, yeah. You just see her body. <laughs> oh, yeah, like from the, from yeah, the door. Yeah, it's like that. And then it's like, you must get rid of the fat one. <laughs> yes, mother. <laughs> And I wanted him. I wanted to bring him back, but he got busy. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I wanted to bring him back to like try to thwart Alan and AJ. The third season was supposed to be more Alan and AJ, but instead I made it more Lyle and Alan. Which was that's, because that's okay. I was writing it that day. <laughs> and and you were also it also gave you a chance to be behind the camera for once. Yeah, we needed somebody behind the camera. It was nice. So yeah, after um after that collaboration, we went up north, far north. The cold north. <laughs> the cold north, where Canada is. So thank you, California Balloon Films, for that awesome, awesome, awesome opportunity to make that that episode, that horror Halloween episode. So, but it wasn't Halloween. <laughs> it was Christmas, but they were doing like they were doing like this horror hollow uh, horror Christmas thing. Yeah, and that was fun. It was fun because we made two things with them, right? 
No, we, we did. We submitted our thing. No, we gave them one. Like it was a joint collaboration where we send them one thing and they send us and they help us with something. Yeah, yeah. So what happened was California Balloon Films. I guess they saw our thing, which was surprising. That's awesome. That's <laughs> and, then, cool. and then they emailed me and they're like, "Hey, you want to do this thing?" And I'm like, "Yeah, sure, let's do this thing." So I wrote Boxing Day. Boxing Day. Yes. Did you ever try to escape? But at the end, the, the message that I wanted to convey was that... Which may or may not be clear. Well, no, I thought it was clear, <laughs> but... It's like, if you have a... All you have, like, if you want to make, like, videos, just just do it. You know? Yeah, because we got... We have how many videos up? Yeah, we have, like, over a hundred videos. We have how many subscribers? We have how... Not that many. Well, we have subscribers, <laughs> though. That aren't us. Yeah. Yeah, that's so true. that's... <laughs> And, and we also have, um, we also got collaborations with people. Like, that... Yeah, it's, the, it's like the whole experience. That's awesome. I wouldn't give that back. Yeah. Like, I don't regret anything that we did. Especially putting you in the dress. Oh, okay. Thanks. I never... <laughs> oh, okay. Because for now on, until the end of time, <laughs> I can do this. Who has never worn a dress? Drink. I'm never going to any parties with you, that's for sure. <laughs> <coughs> Choking. Good. <coughs> Feels good. So what does the future hold for us if not work in progress? Well, while in the middle of work in progress, we came out with a lot of, lot of different things, a lot of different projects, which is really nice. I like whiteboard stories. I like the boob sock shorts. That's going to come out more sparsely <laughs> than every week. Yeah. I'm having trouble right. writing them. Because the thing is, the Boomstock shorts are kind of, like, uh, the whiteboard stories are clearly more uh, real-life experiences. Yeah. But the Boomstock shorts are the live-action equivalent of that, I believe. More or less. The Boomstock shorts are just stuff that, like, I thought was funny. Like, bed sheets. But that, the things that actually happen. Not always. What do you mean, like, not always? There has to be a Boomstock shorts that never happened in real life. Okay. It has to be one, right? Maybe the Jax one. Uh, yeah. But that's, that's like the okay. only one. <laughs> Bim Bum? That's because you sing all the time. And you annoy me, so you're like, okay, Law's gonna annoy AJ. Ha ha ha. You sing all the time. I do sing all the time. <laughs> I like making songs. It's nice. <laughs> I like the laws of a J song. Oh, okay. <laughs> I like how I auto tuned it. That was real. <laughs> that was real. That happened in for real life. There's two versions of that, and we don't know where the uh, the first version is. So, I heard from somewhere <laughs> in the grapevines, murmurings, if you will, that uh, we're that we're doing a new project. Are, are we? How do you know? I heard. Maybe it because you're involved in this project. <laughs> Am I? Who knows? We don't know. I could get fired tomorrow. We don't know. You could get fired tomorrow. I could get fired tomorrow. <laughs> Why'd you tell them about our new project, Lyle? Okay, am I allowed? Just tell them a little bit. All right. So we have this concept. It's basically going to be in the video game setting because we found that during the RPG episodes that we we found it very enjoyable to be doing that. The the voice acting, the way it looks, the way that um. We can move people around, <laughs> you know, like we can control that, that scenario. We can put people in different sets, which is something we've never really done before. We have sets. Yeah. Um, we don't have to be in front of the camera. So Everything's going to be clear. Yeah, everything's going to be clear and in focus. So yeah, like it's basically going to be... An animated TV series, or YouTube series. Animated cartoon YouTube series with video game sprites. It's gonna be 16 bit, y'all. Maybe it'll even bit higher. 32 bit, y'all. So, yeah. Do you wanna release uh, No, the we'll story? just wait till it comes out. The story? 
We'll release it slowly. <laughs> We're gonna leak it slowly. We're gonna leak it slowly. So we could get some uh, some hype about this. <laughs> Whatever no. hype that we could get. Yeah, all the all the three people. <laughs> Those three people from Denmark. This is for you. We're here for you, people in New Zealand. <laughs> so we're gonna end by saying thank you for watching. For Four the, seasons. One year. One year. One year of work in progress. I can't believe it's been so fast. <laughs>